Live on Facebook. We've got four people on YouTube. Yes. Are we YouTube live or Patreon on YouTube live? No, we're live on Facebook, YouTube. Public. Then they can't see you. So. Wow. They can see us. They can see us. She has already quit two times today. We've got 87 people on Facebook, 162 on YouTube, and 81 on Facebook. I don't want to see that stuff on my side. 
next crate win like he shaved his head? Ooh. <laughs> I, think I don't think more. so. I think Mikey is very proud of his hair. Yeah. Like, very. It has to, yeah. He's so particular, it. like, <sighs> are you going to run USMTS all year next?
Like, I like the way the late model race at Plainsboro, but I don't think I'd enjoy mod racing there as much. It may have been good, it may not have been, but... I disagree with that. But I think the mods at Need More were put on the show, because it was kind of, it was racing for sure, but the crates is just pick the pick the line that kind of blocks the racetrack off and run it. So yeah, Need More was, was an awesome facility. They treated it really well. Uh, finally got to meet Chance. And of course, he's like any other business owner. He wasn't happy with the way the track was prepped and this happened and that, but that's business owners. We, we, we're our biggest critics. So uh, I think they ran a great show. I think the track was great. And, you know, it's one of the prettiest tracks I've been to. Yeah. Like the sure. grass, like no holes through the pits. Like Toter Homes didn't almost flip over when we came in. Like it was very well kept. And I'm not taking a shot at Swainsboro because that place was yeah, nice too. Was like great. that was a super, super great facility. Um, yeah. Both places ran a really tight show. Yeah. Um, you know, super impressed with them. All right, so this is an interesting question. Um, I don't know why I have to say so bad. How's the planning of Chase's house coming along on the property next to you all? You should build a barn though with a big shop. So Stan is obviously a longtime fan since he remembers when that five so, acres was purchased. So does Stan have the the Stan want to invest some money? Oh Lord! And what I'm going to say about that is, if he did invest some money, we're getting a nicer uh, hauler to pull our race cars around. Because right now it's it's not it's not that I don't want to have a place of my own and stuff like that, but with the amount of racing we're doing out on the road, like. It's hard to justify having a like a don't like double place to have to kind of I don't know. It's just he can't afford it right now. Yeah, yeah. That's that's what you guys say. Yeah, he went he went the long all way the way around, around to yeah. I can't afford it right yeah. now. I'm broke, Stan. There we go. That's it. I mean, he's trying. Dreams are good to have. Yeah. I know you know what that means. What's that mean? Likes. Oh, me. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Mr. Timothy Sullivan. Thank okay, you. so we're in a competition here, and I'm losing. <laughs> you I'm really are. Me. I'm really losing over here on Facebook. First thing you thought I'd do a little competition. No, no, that's this is Facebook. Oh, okay. I know where I'm at. So, anyways, let me back up no, because I was interrupted. Oh, so, I'm losing. All I need is comments, emojis, likes. Avery's trying to get me to get y'all to spend money. I don't even care about that. Y'all just comment, show us some love, because we've got the most followers over here on Facebook. Avery said I didn't say that. <laughs> she did. She gave me an assignment. That's it. She did. On this one, we're trying to get Galaxy. So uh, yeah. go ahead and send a Galaxy for us. It pops up on the screen. It's really cool. Send a Galaxy and we'll smash his truck Do not touch Rudy's truck It's a different class. 
more mod didn't have enough motor for little tires and Peebly, then that crate definitely don't have enough motor with big tires. We've got a super awesome race car, yeah. but not a yeah, not a super. That's right. Thank you, Mr. Danny. Thank you. We, we miss you. We miss you. Thank you. All right, I got a question for Ruby. Oh. All right. Who is your favorite driver and why? Tanner Mullins. Talk um, loud. Tanner Mullins. Um, why? Um, when Chase used to lose a lot, um, well, that was last week. Uh, no, let's just say um, when he doesn't do the right changes in his car, he loses some, and that would put the new driver to watch him. Dude ain't won a race in a year. <laughs> wow. You're so full of mess. I don't know. I like that. No, 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 no. Wow. Like he said he's like, Mikey said he's going to say, I can't take more. No, uh, no, I, I, I do love Mikey that. also jokes around. Yeah. Like you remember yeah. how I told you in the motorhome, exaggerating and joking and stuff like that? I'm being serious. Because the person that I love. Would you rather coffee or energy drinks?
And then the other thing is we had uh, we had Victory Fuel sponsored to the to the 24 starting drivers of the feature. So uh, 19 guys are going to be awarded. Guys and girls are going to be awarded uh, a case of Victory Fuel. So. Yeah, there was a lot of contingency uh, awards and things that was donated to us for football's race, so we, we greatly appreciate that. I know I know not everybody's happy about me paying it out. I don't know what I mean. Everybody, Adrian's not even happy about me paying out this race without racing it. But you got to understand, we've tried to run this thing three times, this, not this particular race, but my dad's memorial. We've raced, this is the third one, and it has rained out, I think, a total of five times, and it's just too much. It, and, and then and then there's a chance that we're going to reschedule it, and it may rain out again, and I just don't want to. I, I said when it was rained out last time, that was the end of it, and I'm in it. And uh, I know not everybody likes that, but that's what I said, and that's what I'm going to do, and you know, that's just what it is. So... I hate it. I, I'd love to, I mean, you know, I'd love to race it. I mean, we were starting to six. Yeah. So it'd be one thing if we were on the pole and I said, no, we ain't doing it. I could see people getting mad, but we were yeah, starting to Yeah, I guess six. that's the thing. It's yeah. like if we've been sitting on the yeah. pole, I can understand I mean, the racers and people getting upset. But, I mean, we finished six. And yeah, well, like, I, I felt like we had a chance of winning it if we raced. So, yeah, we should have raced, but I just can't drag it out anymore. It's too stressful for me. It's too emotional for me. It, it's a lot, and I just I just can't put me or my family through it. Me and my mom actually made the decision and then discussed it with everybody, and uh, we just decided that, that we're not going to do it anymore. And that if it rained out, that was the end of it, and I'm sticking to that. So congratulations to Noah Daspit. Congratulations to Lucas Lee for second. Congratulations to Kevin Comey for third. That'll put Jay Lusenberg fourth, uh, Hollinsworth fifth, and Chase is sixth, and I'm not sure. Toby Hodge, Toby Hodge, Brian Powell. You know, they're, I, I appreciate everybody that showed up and uh, participated. Absolutely. I appreciate all the sponsors and all the everything that come with it, but we just had to end it like that. Y'all yeah. must have something really important. Yeah. We, it's not important. They're just ruthless on TikTok. About to 
Chase on TikTok. Like actually, or like <laughs> yeah. Asking if those are your sisters or your. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's talk about PPM racing products. So they stepped up to help sponsor the memorial race this weekend, have gone above and beyond for Chase's race program. Huge thanks to those guys over there. Um, we couldn't have done what we've done for that race without them this year. So we're super, super thankful. Um, also, all people that contributed to the Rec Tech bundle, you know, you guys, huge thanks for y'all. Y'all helped pay the purse for that race as well. Thank y'all. Um, did the crate pay more than the modified? Yes and no. Way more um, laps. Yeah, it's a lot more laps. Well, the really, it's not because we don't run meat races. Right. So. Well, the, the races are 20 to 25. Yeah. Um, and anyways, as far as payout goes, like to win Saturday last night was a thousand, and I think we more was what? Wasn't it like fifteen hundred or twelve yeah. hundred? So I mean, yeah, it pays more, but it but it costs yeah. more to raise, so it kind of kind of weighs out the same. They said that Hunt County is racing. Yeah, the weather, weather doesn't look too so, promising. And we're, we're not canceling them, but don't yeah. don't contact them and say, Jay's off, yeah, there it is. It's we're, six we're days saying, away. Yeah, so. yeah. We, we're looking at all options, and that was one there. That one, and we were looking at another one over in the Louisiana area. I was at that. Yeah, yeah, yeah just, to get some. just the chances just don't look that great. Would y'all ever consider running asphalt? Yeah. Never say that. It itself? Yeah. It wouldn't be like if I had the option of dirt or asphalt, it'd be dirt for sure. stuff. 
stuck behind the wheel of a modified, yeah, a crate car would be really easy to drive. But coming from a modified going into a crate, it is very difficult to drive because a modified, you have to be up on the wheel constantly, constantly moving, making the car do what you want it to do. And I find myself in that crate car trying to slow myself down and let the car do what it's supposed to do instead of anticipating something that's not going to happen and overdriving or underdriving. It, it's, it would be easy if I never drove anything besides a late model, but, but I don't know. They're, they're easy and difficult in their own ways. So, both fun. So, I think this is funny. So, Pinkerton just hopped on. Uh oh. Fireball, what's that? Congrats to the family. When we met, you had less than 1,500 followers. Chavis was walking around Bristol with a camera, and I thought, who is this knucklehead dad? Ha ha, boy, was I wrong. So funny story about that. We were in the infield at Bristol, and I saw your car, and I was like, ooh, that's a pretty car. He looks like big money. Yeah. I uh, still uh, remember saying that yeah. about the years. <laughs> but then you came over, and you were a normal, down to earth, yeah. normal, yeah. down to yeah. earth yeah. nice guy. Yeah, absolutely. It's funny about those first impressions. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, weird. Huh? No, weird. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, just thought it was so Yeah, I did. I honestly, like Adrian said, I, I felt like he, he definitely had good equipment and everything. Y'all got to realize that was, we had just got that yeah. 2018 MD Custom, and that was the nicest stuff we ever had. And, you know, Fireball had his stuff together, and he looked like a yeah. veteran. Yeah, and we looked like, like a plane that's rolling I mean, this dude's name is Fireball Pinkerton. I mean, you're, that's a racing fast name right there, you know. So. It, yeah, it didn't have really a good. mark on it. Yeah, yeah that's awesome. We, we're going to catch up with you and, and go, go do some racing together. So, for sure, looking forward to it. What are your opinions on IMCA racing? Um, it's, it's, it's racing, but past that, um, I'd rather go up than mod racing, yeah. personally. There's a lot of people that pass that. And, 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 you know, it's like anything else. If we did enough of it, we'd probably start to like it because you get better and, you know, obviously that's what we're all trying to do. But. All right, everybody. Does anyone have a question for Ruby? Anybody? Anybody have a question for Ruby? I just saw one from Mr. Danny. What are okay. you eating? Huh? What are you eating? Um, popcorn. It's not cheesy, but it's not buttery. It's my it's popcorn. <laughs> it is. It's it is organic, gluten-free, coconut, Himalayan salt popcorn. <laughs> yeah, what are you drinking in your cup? Water. Water. Chase, when are you bringing back the mullet? Uh, I have no desire to bring back the mullet. That's, that, that shit sound and as a as a 16 year old, and now when I see people with mullets, especially that are the age that I was when I had a mullet, I just think of how stupid I was. Man, I think they're cool. Mullet was cool. I think they're, and when I see guys with a mullet, I do that's cool. Do you people think you're better than everyone else? Absolutely. I mean, what kind of question? <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, you know, okay, Ruby's question is here. Ruby's question is here. Thank you, Jim. Ruby, how are the horse lessons going? Get my slippers. <laughs> um, so I am not been doing horse lessons because I am starting swim lessons. And Mikey told me the other day that I can be a horse swim singer. I could, I could swim in the water while singing. And I said, oh, my God. And then, but, um, yes, I'm. I have one for Chase as well. Which car can you drive that? Well, I struggle equally in all of them. What's your question? Mr. Bob said to tell you that Ozzy misses you. Oh. Is Chase? Is Chase shooting for a chin porcupine as well? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's, that's what I'm going for. I'm probably, since you said that, I'm probably going to He wins the, the, he wears the Phineas and Ferb cut now. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all are my heroes over Where here. Mikey he was tired and Mikey wanted to go home. I fired him. About 45 minutes ago, I had to let him go. Um, 
schedule for this year. When we say that week up, we are watching the weather, trying to find a Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday night show in the same area. We really are. We're checking the weather, trying to line it out. Um, we're really just going with the flow this year. So, I mean, we could end up at your track any week at any given time based on the weather and where the wind blows us. When you coming back to I think about Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Try not to get too, too, I don't know. There's a lot of places to go. We don't, yeah. want, to, we don't want to keep repeating. In the words of Mikey, we'll be there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we'll be there this weekend. Yeah, we'll be there. All right, well, Mikey. I said that on it. Yeah. I handled that. No, I got it. This this is my last event with Chase Hall and Racing. Um, I'm leaving. Come on, Ruby. We plan to go, well, uh, we were planning to go to Architect Saturday, but with the weather the way that it is, I don't think that's going to happen. Georgia? Honey, baby.
He is. Wow. Yeah, they're scared. I thought these babies shut down. Yeah, that's what this Ricky said, is that they're running Great Lake Knowles at East Bay. That's Ricky Bobby. And, um, uh, uh, who is Ricky Bobby? The one that said I was a what? Jelly Roll. Great Valley University of Jelly Roll. Man, that would be me up. How do y'all keep up with this? Because it hurt our feelings. You don't forget. Adam, he's not for sale. He's ours. We ain't got a sticky icky for a who we sell? We're not selling nobody. Mikey's not for sale. Oh, no. Somebody was trying to take Mike. That's Adam Willis. He's actually just, <laughs> he actually just said, how can they find a Mikey? He likes, he likes some uh, ladies' honey buns. Yeah. He likes that and Sprite. If you can, if you might be able to get him. You might. He likes star crunches. No, he'll tear a honey bun up. Cereal. Yeah, and cereal. Yeah, and cereal. He likes um, and chicken colossal crunch. He did ask me though, all the way down from Missouri to Florida, if I would buy him honey buns, and he Are did you not serious? stop. Yes, yeah. he did he not stop. That, the white glazed honey buns. Mike, yeah. I'll get you some honey buns. Yeah. Nobody told me. But all, all the seriousness, Adam. Uh, Mikey was just a local kid that, uh -huh. that enjoyed racing and had a passion for it. And we gave him a shot. Man, he's been, he's family. He's been great. Glad to have him. Yeah, up. for sure. There'll never be another Mike Drury. That's a fact. Uh, Shane, Hurricane Shane wants to know, Christmas is right around the corner. Do you have any knives left? <laughs> Plenty of them. Plenty. I got them all on the way. And they're on the west side. Dude, I saw that the other day. What the hell? I, like, I just watched and I was like, we can't post that. And I was like, people know by now. <laughs>
James, thank you so much. So that's a uh, May 4th through the 7th. The CA so wrong date, but okay. Go ahead. What I say? Go ahead. Go with it. Yeah, it's close. First weekend of May, the CHR race bus is going to be parked that weekend. Uh, unless Uncle Ed wants to take the racing. No, absolutely. Ed Smith, we're not racing. So Adrian and I try to go on date night once a week. And Mikey, I don't know if you heard Adrian, but Mikey said he thought that was pretty cool that we do that. But uh, we've been doing that for years. Yeah, years. We've been going on date night one one night a week to go out to dinner. And uh, that's that's something we try to do where we can go just talk and relax and stuff. And uh, and yeah, we do have some some uh, alone stuff to do here soon. So. It's always great. After. After getting comfortable in the late model and learning changes on it, do you feel like it's similar to the mod as far as setup? Yes. Changes of things we do? I do agree with that, yes. We've done a lot of the same stuff that we've done to our mod to get it freed up, and it, it responded well to it for the most part. So. I think this is a perfect question, not to cut it off. How are you liking the tow mod, especially after today's drive? Um, well, it, I, I love my toter as far as like, once I'm at the racetrack, it is like the nicest thing. I don't know how we ever did did what we've done without a stacker. Um, but as far as getting to and from, when we go through the little small towns of Georgia and the traffic of Illinois and, uh, you know, the, the desert oil fields of, Bado, New Mexico, we're, we're over in New Mexico in the mountains and stuff. I hate it. I hate it. I wish I wish my daddy was still driving me around in the country. It was nice when, when daddy was doing doing ninety percent of it. So it was nice. Ninety, I'm doing a hundred. Son, that other ten, I got behind the wheel. You let me drive. More like hours. more like point one zero. Thank you, Avery. What? I Oh, were you asking a question? Okay, that's What track is the most scary for your family to watch you? Hamilton County. No, I'm going to say local races. Those are the yeah, ones where I'm it's like. Weird. It's very strange that local racing makes my heart pound, man. It's just, and it's not fear that, that Chase is going to do something that gets him hurt, but it's just like, uh, I don't know. After being on a scale with USMTS and seeing how they race, it's like a little yeah. nerve wracking yeah, yeah, to yeah. see. Yeah, some of our, our weekly competitors are, are very unpredictable. Yeah. And it's, 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 it's a task. What you got, Ray? People have passes, I mean, miles over. Um, they have Uh, I went the, the week, the Sunday before, and saw, I went over to my people's to go out on the boat with him, and he had his blue dealer there, which is old, really, really old. And very calm. Very, and very yeah. mellow. Um, and I was like, man, she's such a good dog. I'm going to have one of these someday. And then I just had the feeling that I was going to end up seeing one that day, and, and I, knew, I knew if I saw one, it was Sign to get one, and uh, sure enough, I stopped at a gas station in Osceola, Arkansas, and that little thing, chunky thing, was right in front of the gas pump. Yeah. Oh. The rest is history, right? It was smooth selling. Easy breezy. If you had a great, great dog, uh, she has. If you had a million dollars, what would you do? Both. I, I'll answer Last that. He blows. About two weeks, he'd be broke. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, but hold up. Hold no, up. he'd get a boat. You know that I had a million when I got done spending. You would. I you would definitely know because I know which rig. Which we rig would he would have nothing left. Calling him saying 
a son, you only had a million. You spent, a, you you made promises for a million and a half. Anyway, next. So, Chase's view count is winning, but Seriously. Mama's star count uh, yes. is winning. Yes, that's my people. You've got yes. 498 stars oh, over here. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. and every one of y'all, 154 is... Somebody call him. 
on love. No, Let's call him on love. You're. You tell him you're love. He'll be PG. All right. in the race car for graduation. That's a good idea. That is a good idea. Are we going to go on before December? Thank you, Mr. Marty. Somebody said that was a fair draw. Give him the grill. It was a fair draw. I mean, I wanted to rig it. Honestly. I did. In the works. No, uh, we got it. He's got plenty of Mike Aaron Rock's got t shirts. Yeah. Give him a door. Heck yeah, Mr. Marty. Avery needs a pay raise and he sent me some money. <laughs> wow. Thank you so Thanks, much. Mr. Thank Marty. You, Mr. Marty. Does anybody have any questions? She quit three times today. Yeah, you do really good with Mr. Marty. For real sure. and for real reason. Let Mikey run yeah. the street stock race. Yes. Anybody Where's the street have stock? any more yeah. questions? Thank you, Mr. Timothy. Oh, that's a Andrew, Andrew. You don't have your hat on. Oh, I know. I did. Where you got a double barrel hat? No. What did you get? What did you say? You got? Yeah, I got one. Andrew's on here. Ask Andrew where your hat is. 
He got a hat. Now, Andrew <laughs> don't even know I got a hat because Vincent took it from him to give it to me. Yeah, Andrew actually didn't know about it. Man, that's now some cool right there. Flat deal. We got the yeah. You just got a motor. Well, it says it's some sort of new kit. Yeah, that was cool. Stop. Mike, you need a shirt that says Mike Poncho. <laughs> <laughs> watching. Oh, Lord. Somebody done told her? I don't know. Thank you, Brandon, for the stars. Yes, thank you, Brandon. Am I the lead again? What am I the lead I'm trying to win. I'm trying to What's win. What's up, old man? man? Wheel man. He ought to be ready for a new rap by now. He tore half of it off the deep south that next night. No, don't hate on for No, I'm not. Definitely not hating. Um, Jordan, we talked about Need More and Swainsboro earlier. We love both tracks. Both of them put on a super, yeah. super great tight show. It was we were efficient. done 9.30. 9.30. Y'all, we were done. Car in the trailer last night. My mom night. asked me this morning. She was like, she said, when y'all said y'all were born, she said it was like 8.30 here. And I was like, yeah. And we were our head there. But yeah, it was quick. Oh, these are good questions. Good questions. How did the merch girls do in Georgia? Good. Good. Yeah. yeah. Very good. All right, Travis, this is for you. Coming from Jeremy Eaton out of Stone so County. Hey, Jeremy. We oh, maybe that's not Jeremy Eaton. No, uh, I don't know. Anyways, does Travis use a straightener on his beard? Absolutely. What's your question? Um, somebody said they need a 6X t-shirt. We yeah, have we them. We have plenty of 6X. Get, get, that, uh, get the pocket knife on there while you, while you order. Check that out. Or some keychains or a wallet. <laughs> I'm sorry. Get rid of it. Oh, you broke it? Ooh, we, we can no longer vlog on YouTube. We're shut the YouTube yep, down. Yeah, we're out. Camera birds. We're done. Mr. Marty said he's needing a new hot pink shirt, maybe with a late model on it. Okay, I'll add that to my order. Been watching you guys for two years, Thank and you. you were my favorite YouTuber. Thank you. Thank you. Do the folks who provide your fastener bins sponsor you? They're my competition. Fastener bins? I'm assuming this thing. No, we can't do that. Yeah. Y'all keep hitting that like button. All right. Last time, 
Any more questions before we go watch American Idol? Any questions for me at all? Oh. What's your favorite ice cream, Ruby? What's your favorite ice cream? I have actually two favorite ice creams. One is dinner on Christmas time. I never got a Travis, but um, it was good. I bet to Chase. It's uh, a Christmas cookie with sprinkles, but I don't have the sprinkles probably. But that and um, when I was little, I used to get vanilla ice cream with sprinkles with chocolate syrup. That's right. It's good. No peppermint, Audrey. That's right. She does not like mint at all. Who do you think is going to win American Idol? Oh. Oh. Well, they voted off people, y'all. No, yeah. I forget the guy's name, the big guy with the beard, red hair that was a football player. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He, oh, he, yeah. He, is it I don't know his name. That's, that's Mosley or something. I think Last name. Maybe. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You're right. She's good, too. Yeah. I don't remember the names. I just know they all choose. How many wins do you have, Chase? Uh, five this year. Overall, in my lifespan, I don't know. I would say uh, so, Chase, high 40s. Park racing, bond racing. Mm -hmm. Way more than that. Way more than that. How many do you have in our race? Yeah, way more than Mike. Let's put it like that. Too many on our race, and I have to let people down. I have a question for Chase. Um, Mike is saying you wreck him a lot on our racing. I've got video to prove that it's the opposite way around. Okay.
Thank you, Don. We appreciate you. Very nice. Very we'll nice. We'll have some YouTube videos up here shortly. Not shortly, but like tomorrow. tomorrow. And throughout the week, we'll let y'all know on Facebook where we're racing at. Uh, you won't find out until the day of unless you're patient. If you're patient, you'll know kind of like Three the day days. before. <laughs> so, all right. Great advertising. We're shutting her down here. Bye. Later.